Tectonic shift. Shaping the future with innovation. Hello everyone and welcome back. In this video, we will learn about the chat GPT context and token limits. Beside those limitations I mentioned in the previous lecture, there is another chat GPT limitation and also in general, large language model limitation you should be aware of. The input you are sending to chat GPT is kind of limited or put in other words, you can't send super large amounts of inputs to chat GPT. Because chat GPT or to be precise, those GPT models that are being used under the hood have a token limit. Now you might recall tokens are these things which are used instead of words and as mentioned earlier, a token can be a word but also be a part of a word. And tokens have these IDs which are then used by the model. But it's all about these tokens in the end, therefore. And these GPT models have token limits and the exact limit simply depends on the GPT model that is being used. This token limit therefore simply defines the maximum amount of text that can be handled by these GPT models. And therefore, of course, also by chat GPT. And it's not just about the text you are passing to chat GPT. Instead, since it is a chat, it's about the entire chat history. Because one huge advantage of chat GPT is that it's a chat and is that it keeps those old chat messages. It keeps your messages in mind and considers them in combination with your new prompt. Whenever you are sending a new prompt to chat GPT, this allows you to ask chat GPT about something that might have been part of an earlier chat message. But therefore, of course, it's always the entire chat that has to be handled by chat GPT as an input and therefore it's the tokens of that entire chat that are taken into account by chat GPT and that count towards that token limit. And these token limits, this limited context really matters. For one, chat GPT doesn't allow you to insert super long prompts. If you, for example, want to use chat GPT to summarize a very long document and you paste in the entire document combined with your prompt, your question, chat GPT might not accept this. But besides that, chat GPT also simply starts to forget certain things as your chat history grows. If you go beyond that token limit, Chat GPT simply forgets certain things it already replied before or you already sent to Chat GPT before. And this token and context limit is therefore, of course, a very important limitation you should be aware of. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to stay tuned for exciting videos that are coming up under this prompt engineering podcast. Take care and bye bye.